My name is Minnie Clark. I'm a member of the Teslin Clinket Council, and my Clinket name is Cogene. I love all types of art. I started out with photography. When I was a young girl growing up, my mother taught me how to bead. And if we wanted spending money, she would say, okay, make something and I'll sell it for you. As we beaded, you know, we started off making little rings or bracelets and little pins. And then as we got older, she taught me to make a pair of moccasins. We also had a trap line and I worked out on the trap line with my family. Love getting up early in the morning. I find that's my best time to sew and when I'm most creative. I think of my mother because she loved to sew in the morning. And I think because all the little kids were asleep, she could get so much more done. I think sometimes you run out of ideas. Then you gotta sit down and start thinking. I usually Pinterest a lot because I get a lot of ideas from other sewers and I'll just look online and find different patterns, or if I'm out for a walk, I'll look at the different types of flowers and stuff and see how I can incorporate those into patterns, and I'll utilize those. I try to trap and utilize as much as I get from the line, but I also will buy locally from other trappers. I know last year I had um, a friend come in from Teslin and he brought a big gunny sack full of tan beaver pelts and they were really good because I had a workshop right after that and we were able to use those and it had so much meaning because all the girls in the workshop they knew who trapped it where they came from so it had special meaning too. I want people to know that it's all artwork the patterns, the ideas, everything has been passed down from my family. The big thing was my mom always shared her patterns. She was always willing to teach people. And if we want our young kids to learn and to carry on these traditions, we have to be open and share our patterns and just spend time with the youth and teach them.